This is Cannon Fodder, the channel for transfer news only involving Arsenal players coming in and out of the club. Right, so um, as we've known for quite a few days now, Unai Emery is the new Arsenal manager. And one thing that we need to do is to get rid of the DNA um, that is still remaining um, from the previous manager, which is Arsene Wenger. Now, I know there's been lots of talk about some players um, on the internet and social media in regards to uh, this guy called um, Lichtensteiner, uh, who's probably coming on free transfer. I've got a couple of alternatives based on the performance over the last two to three years. Our attack is probably one of the best that we have in Lacazette um, and Aubameyang and to a certain extent Danny Welbeck. However, I want Sven Nissentak and uh, Unai Emery to maybe look at these two players to strengthen the team. First and foremost, the goalkeeper. Petr Cech, thank you for your service, but I think you need to be put out to pastures green. Um, you were a great goalkeeper for um, the other um, London club, which is Chelsea. Again, I also have a way of bringing players who are coming towards the end of their careers. Check needs to be put out. So my alternative would be Jack Butland. Jack Butland, I hear you say. Jack Butland. The guy's been selected for the World Cup squads. He's um, English. He's still young. He's 25. And he's a commanding goalkeeper. Why can't we put... Um, why can't we like try and buy you know Jack Butler? He's a really good player, good goalkeeper. You can't do any worse than um, Czech or Ospina. So yeah, we we should put out you know maybe or try and uh, attempt to buy uh, Jack Butler. So that's one player. We have known the defense has been our Achilles heel for so many matches. We have had one of the worst away records in living memory since 1966 seven or was it six away um, losses in a row so let's try and develop and improve the defense get rid of Mustafi Koscielny yeah he's coming towards the end of his career even though he's had the, the injury with his Achilles and we've said as well you know we're very sorry to hear that he's not going to be going obviously to the World Cup Holding is going to need more time uh, to become a top-line central defender. So, my alternative would be um, Jeremy uh, Mathieu. He's currently at um, Sporting Lisbon. And the reason why I'm saying that, <coughs> because I've, I've seen some matches where he's a left-footed central defender. The guy is very, very fast. He's good at reading uh, matches. And he's not, you know what, he's not, a, he's not afraid of getting stuck in there. Um, there's one link between him and Unai Emery. Um, he was at Valencia at the same time as um, Unai Emery. So they've got that connection. The only one thing that I will say that um, Hedemi has against him is his age. He's 34, 35 years old. But, you know, the recent videos I've seen of this guy, he, you know what? He would put a lot of the younger players to shame. Again, he's good at reading the matches, you know, really tough in the tackle. And if we ever wanted, you know, uh, an enforcer in the central, you know, defence, I would have Hedemi uh, Matthew, you know, there. And again, because Unai has had, you know, he's been uh, manager with Valencia, they've got that connection already. So... These are my two alternative players that I would bring in um, to, you know, the Arsenal set up, knowing fully well that we've got Unai Emery as a new manager, clear out all the rubbish and, you know, buy those two players. But, you know, tell me, what do you think? So this is the first upload in regards to Cannon for the transfers for players coming in and out of Arsenal FC. But until then, this has been Cannon Fodder.